Hello Habibi here. In this video tutorial, I'm going to show you how to create a train and wagon movements. I will share a Unity package with you. The link I will put the link in the description of this video. And the content of the package is these files. Okay, this scene is from is this one so if you open this scene you can play this train movement here is the locomotive and the wagons okay so you can try by downloading the package and importing it to unity and try this scene but let me tell you that this packages is not made by me so i downloaded it from a website a good website it has good unity tutorials so this package is one of uh, the packages that is available in this website so i downloaded it and modified the, some of the codes here so let's say you have downloaded the package and imported it to the unity let's start to create uh, let's start to create the train by creating a wagon so i'm going to create a scene a new scene here here in new scene we are going to create a new empty game object and here let's see the original scene here we need this spline loop so basically this is an empty game object with this bezier spline script so you can add that script into this game object bezier spline okay and here we are going to create it is initially has some points some curve points let me show you so it is initially it has two points here here and here it has handles to adjust the curve let's add some points we can add a curve here this is the newly created curve let's set it to mirror and this one also mirror you can choose whatever fits your need okay let's add let's check this loop check mark to make a loop L loop line like this let's add more curve yeah it is a bit messy we need to adjust the points the curve so basically it is a rail railroad it is the track that the train will move it the train will follow this line So you can adjust it uh, however you want and let me just uh, finish it 
okay I think it is enough now we have this uh, railroad or track the track so we need to create the wagon first we need to add a locomotive here is a folder called SWT prefabs open it here we have locomotive and this one wagon let's drag and drop the locomotive to the scene like this now we need to add a script to this locomotive it already has the script so it has this spline walker script and we need to drag and drop the let me rename it to track let's drag and drop this track into this uh, slot spline slot so we have this <coughs> track here and the duration is the is the timing or the duration this locomotive will uh, move completely around the circle or the track so let's okay let's try running this game uh, this scene click play button as you can see this locomotive is moving uh, following this track if you edit the track the, the locomotive will adjust its movement too you can adjust it however you want Okay, it is the locomotive. We need wagon behind this locomotive. So to add wagon, let me delete this point. I don't want this point to be like that. To delete to delete the point you can click this button and you can add another curve point oh let's add another point okay somehow like this it's fine let's add the wagon now this is the wagon prefab you can drag and drop it here we need to set up this wagon to we need to link it to the locomotive let's switch to the top view of the scene like this and drag the position and you can see this uh, brown brown dot here brown uh, place it like this now go to the inspector you can see this connection body slot here we need to drag and drop this uh, locomotive the whole locomotive here okay so let's try running this scene now you see the wagon is attached to the locomotive but its position is not correct let's fix it It should not be there. It must be here. Okay. It 
must be at the same uh, height of the locomotive let's try running this in again here is our wagon it is attached to the locomotive let me select the spline the track so we can see the track of this train you can adjust the speed of this train by clicking the locomotive and modifying the the value of this duration for example if you want to make it move faster so you can decrease the value for example 5 or maybe 2 if you want to make it more slower you can put something like 30 50 or whatever you want so that is the locomotive and wagon what if we want to add another wagon it's easy you can you can just uh, click and duplicate this wagon control D press control and D like this adjust its position and here in this slot we need to uh, drag and drop the first wagon object into this slot let's add another wagon again now we are going to drag and drop this wagon to the slot if you hit play button you will see the train moving like this you can see this crazy movement yes so, I don't know maybe you can fix it maybe you can try to fix it by creating more reasonable track this track is too small I think so let's resize it let me resize it track Let, let's create it more wider longer I know it is not perfect but maybe some at some point this will work for you this crazy movement we can fix it by slowing down the train movement so go to the locomotive and in decrease the speed if you want to decrease the speed you must increase the value maybe 30 so at this speed the train movement is good I think you can add more wagons behind this wagons so that is it so that's all it is the tutorial for creating a simple train and locomotive and wagon in unity thank you for watching this tutorial and see you next time